Hello everyone, Misty Vale here. Welcome back to Critter Cove. All right, so I did try and recur, record a little earlier today, but um, yeah, missed out on some gameplay because the game glitched, my computer glitched, and yeah, I'm sorry. <laughs> so this is the same save that I did earlier, only we're a little further ahead. We got a couple of people's houses um, built. We got Mary in. We've got this girl who's Tammy who's coming in. Um, her house is fixed. She's giving me a treat or a something, a bird cage. Oh, goody, just what I wanted. Okay, so she's going to tear down the scaffolding and reveal her house because she's been working on it hard. And it's super cute. I'm just a little worried about this balcony here because there's no support on it. I think, I kind of think there should be some support beams here. It's kind of dodgy, but okay. So, uh, what I was trying to do when everything got weirded out, even though it saved everything for some reason, um, we have our clothing store up, but we don't have anybody to assign it to. And, um, oh dear, yes, can I help you? And see, I don't have an option to let anybody... Uh, be assigned. Usually when you talk to somebody, there'll be a bottom option under the let's talk goodbye that says assign job and it'll let you do that. But no, no, no. Oops, sorry, wrong button. Don't have that here. And I'm not sure why. I don't know if maybe Renard has to talk to me. Um, okay, so apparently not. Um, there was a big update today. Um, today is Monday, the night the 16th, 9-16. So, um, they've, uh, updated some more things. They've, uh, added three more residents availability to be in your town. They've, uh, added three more homes that are available. Uh, the reason I reek so much is I wear a filthy horse blankets instead of big girl clothes. Bam! You just got pokey slammed. My insults have been a bit flat lately. I'm trying to spice them up. That was funny. What? That wasn't supposed to be funny. You're supposed to be devastated right now. Just ruined a perfectly good insult with ugh, your positivity. No, no. Come back here, pokey. E. I can't say I'm happy to see you, but I guess seeing you isn't the worst thing either. So right here, there should be an option for me to assign job. But... I'm not getting it. So I don't know what's going on. Now I do need two friendship bracelets, one with Pokey and one with somebody else. And this is Pokey's house. No, this is my house. This is my house. My bad. Thought it was Pokey's. Oh, well, okay. So I just got some wallpaper. Um, I have a bird cage here. That is the tiniest bird cage I've ever seen. Oh my god. So to shift it, you just, just what it says, shift plus your middle mouse key to rotate it. And I just did put in some wind chimes up on the wall. So I don't know what I'm going to do about assigning somebody to the clothing store because... I need somebody in there to run it, but apparently nobody has the option to, uh, yeah, to run it. And in my other save, I actually had Pokey running it and she loved her job. She was really good at it. You I need more tourists, more tourists mean more money, but also means you'll need to make more attractions. That's the problem for tomorrow. Today's issue is simply to get people to come here. Fortunately for me, for you, I sell the solution. Just buy the bonus tourist package. A bit pricey, but ultimately worth it. Top notch. Yes. Okay, so... The ultimate tourist package is $1,000. And I have 393 So we need to sell some stuff. Let me talk to Tammy. Come back here. I think I got a couple of minutes before my heart rate heart rate fa falls. What can I do for you, Fierce? Again, I'm not understanding 
what I'm missing with this. I can't even go in here. Ah, oh, this frustrates me. Closed. No one is designed to work here. Maybe it's just a bug I have to report. I don't, I don't know. I need white seashells to make my, let me see something. Did I, okay. I've got to go here. Repair the broken, repair the control panel, talk to Barnacle. So this is talk to Barnacle. I don't see anything else. Repair the control panel. Okay, that must be the oil rig. So I think for the oil rig, I just need um, the gear. No, I need a simple motor. Simple motor. Okay, I've got that. So on our way to look for shells. <laughs> Sorry, is there chaotic? Um, on our way to look on an island for shells and to get that salvageable stuff out there, I am going to first get this stuff. Then I'm going to go to the oil rig. Actually, no. Then I'm going to go to that island right, right straight ahead of us and turn in our fishing rod or collect some actually catch some fish because we got our fishing rod. So let's do this. We got to catch five fish. And I think it was a specific type of fish. It's like, okay, can do that. So let's see, and there are also, bleh, there are also eggs on this island. Specifically, whoops, specifically green eggs, which you will get a quest like here for Reynard. So that was one. There's another one right there. And there's just a regular egg. Oh, that's a coconut. And then there's a regular egg right here. So be aware when you go to islands, there could be little nests where you can get some eggs for your cookie. There's some more green eggs. So there's like three green eggs on this island. So I want to take my fishing rod and put it up here. Oh, that's not going to work out well. Well, I'm going to have to eat, eat a fruit veggie meal because I ain't got no room for fish. <laughs> now, this was like Stardew. The fishing in here was very like Stardew, but I think they got a lot of complaints. So now all you do is kind of like Coral Island, but in a lesser degree. You cast your line, you'll see this big black shadow right approaching my fishing line. That's going to be your fish. It'll bite anywhere from one to four times. Then word strikes at the hook. You do that, you click your left mouse button, and boom, you caught a fish. And it says my inventory is full, which it wasn't full a minute ago. Um, I am going to get rid of... Um, oh god, I need everything. I'm going to get rid of that sea acorn. I should have put the Wayne's cutting out. So basically, it'll tell you when to click. It'll say strike or something like that. And that's your cue to click. And um, you just click on it and boom, you got the fish. So much easier. There's this cute little fish. A gupper or something like that. Yep, a gupper. And I think I need five of those guys. Oh, wait. Did I not do that? Oh, God. So, fishing... Oh, wow. What is that? Metal number plate. So, I got a license plate. <coughs> Excuse me. So, if I go here and I go here... So, I have to talk to Barnacle. Oh. This is where I glitched. All right, she's a real beauty. Nothing like my Polina, of course, but a pole any fisher would be proud of. Hmm. You'll need to test her out. Only way to test out a pole is to catch and fish. Island has a few nice and easy fish swimming around its shores. They practically catch themselves. 
How about you catch me five guppers? That should be a nice beginner challenge. Just toss your line in the water, wait for a strike, hook the fish. Then keep it in your pole sweet spot to reel them in, simple as can be. Catch those fish, come back and show me. Inked, I'm so excited to see a young angler start their journey. So I guess that, <laughs> I guess that one gupper we just caught does not count. But you never know. So you can see again, the shadow just comes up. It'll say strikes at the, at the hook. Boom, you got the fish. There's a gupper. They're really cute. I actually have in town, I have a, a little ride where you go back and forth of a gupper. It's super cute. And you don't need bait, but yet you're going to open a bait shop on the island. So I don't know what that's about. Oh, I got a oxygen tank, so that's cool. A rusty tank. I am going to delete this license plate because I don't know what that's for. Um, and I really do need, I guess I can get rid of this lettuce. Just got to make sure because I don't know how many different types of fish there are. I'm sure there's a lot. But I have not done any extensive fishing in this game yet. So we'll see. I got um I got a propeller. Not what I was hoping for. I, d I need some fish, guys, not some trash. <laughs> and you can sell your fish, you can cook your fish. I don't know if if cooked versus raw fish, which is more expensive. You can talk to Reynard and see which you know, click on the fish and click uh, sell or click the fish and it should come up with a price. So you can see which is which. Probably I'm going to say most games have cooked food more expensive than the raw ingredients. Just what I've noticed, but it's anyone's guess. Oh, okay. We got oh, that's a new one. We got a golf club. Cool. I don't think my character is going to want to go golfing, but you never know. There might be a mini golf game somewhere around. Okay, I think we have to catch one more. Because the game didn't recognize the first one we caught because I hadn't done that quest. And say I glitched out. Like I said, I was having problems. I don't know if it was OBS or my computer or both. It's just been a Monday. <laughs> oh, um, another license plate. Um Well. Everything is necessary. I'm just going to get rid of the rope then. So if your inventory is full, I don't know if it goes to your mail or if it goes, it just disappears if you're fishing. I have a feeling it just disappears and you lose whatever you couldn't fit in your inventory. Oh, that's a squidlet. It's a squid type fish. Okay. Squidlet, yeah. I'm looking for a gupper. And I got a tire. Inventory is full. Okay. <laughs> and if you need to check your, your mail, because you should check your mail, uh, the post box is right by Anchor Shop. To the right of it as you face it. Oh, come on. I don't know what is going on here. And it doesn't look like fishing takes up any energy as well, or stamina. So that's a good thing. Because in other games like Dinko and what and whatnot, um, oh good, there's our last fish. Uh, it does cost energy. Yay! Okay, we caught five gupper. Let's go talk to, to this guy. I have something for... Oh, we have to give him the fish? Oh man. 
Look at those beautiful fish. It's just so beautiful. Hold it together, Barnacle. I can't help it. Seeing the first catch of a new angler is so much, too much emotion for me to keep inside. You've made this old fisherman proud. Natural born fisherman. Okay. I'm fine now. Did you know that fish are not only great for cooking, but they're also an excellent source of oil? You just need to smash them up all good like. Fish facts. <laughs> You've done such a good job. I feel like I should teach you something else. Fish racks are stylish and bring just the right odor to any fish village. Take care. Keep practicing. I'll bet you'll be talk taking on real monsters of the sea soon. Those fish ain't going to catch themselves. Um, okay. <laughs> Whatever. I, I learned a recipe for fish rack. I guess that's like a drying rack where you can put you can put some fishies. Okay, so now we gotta go to the oil rig, which I believe is out this way. And you can use your middle mouse wheel to pull back. Um, it's gotta be right over here. Sometimes you, if you swing side to side, you can catch an outline. There it is. And right now there are several areas in a big circle around the outer edges that are not. Oh wow, shipwreck. That are not available. You'll you'll get sent back to the nearest point because they're just not open. They'll be say that's under construction. Sorry. Like oh well, already then. Pardon me. Okay, so what we're doing, I've already replaced two gears uh, right in here. I've replaced a pipe here. So now we are just replacing the simple motor and voila. And then before we talk to him, there is, oh, there's a golden egg up there. Ha ha. There's also this cart, a balloon cart. And we picked up, oh, geez Louise. All right, Squidlet, I'm sorry. Golden egg, gotta have the golden egg. There will be a music, 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 museum on this island, just like Coral Island, just like Dinkum. Well, I'll be a drowned rat. I didn't think you'd actually do that. I uh, might have underestimated you, underestimated you, maybe. My name's Riggs O'Malley. I run this old rig. Right pleasure to meet you. Well, if nothing else, I'm a rat of my word. Take this blueprint. You'll never know when you're going to need to blast something out of your way. Oh, thank you. Okay. Blasting charge. If, uh, okay. S Secret to farming underwater. All you need to do is make an aqua planner. Best way to learn is to mis dismantle sunken ones that are all over the base of this rig. Go ahead, dive down, rip them apart. I'll show your, you, I'm sure you'll figure it out soon enough. I think you need 14. Okay, come on now, move. Okay, so do I have, I just have this one tank and I have no room left. So we're not gonna do that right now. We are just gonna, Get up in here. Oh, excuse me. There is an island uh, off this this way. I just need some. Sh I need two white shells. Maybe. Oh no, I can't find them there. There's a big set of islands out here. There. This way. That have a bunch of resources on them. I might be able to switch some stuff around and. Find two white shells, and then we can make those friendship bracelets for, um, oh, that's not the right one. <laughs> that's the sunken city. I don't know how they got trees growing on top of the city, but they do. So this is an old, like, uh, New York style downtown area. The top of some skyscrapers that are poking out of the water after there was some apocalyptic flood. We will need to go here soon enough, but not right now. There is a set of islands that are out here somewhere that have, hang on, right here. So this is where I'm going, so just basically straight ahead-ish. 
And we will eventually run right into them. Or pass right by them. One of the two. Ah, we are definitely ahead. I can see the outline of them now. It's sort of like four or five little islands jumped together with a little bit of water in between. There hopefully will just be two white shells. That's all I need. And I think I might be able to fish from this boat. If you stop driving, I swear those look like orange slices. If you stop driving, you should be able to fish from your boat, theoretically. You can't really go into the cove here because of the sand. Um, all sorts of things. I am just looking specifically. There's marble here. This is marble. So you will need marble slabs. So you'll need to come here for your marble. And again, this is the island chain that we are on right here. This is Critter Cove. This is the lighthouse. So it's directly a straight shot from the lighthouse. And one, two, three, four. Five islands. They all have marble on them. There are a couple of quests here that you need to do. Um, there's some lettuce in the water around here. If you look, you can see some like right here. There's some buried treasure. There's some fish to catch. I am specifically looking for just, there's also like this, this um, plant will eventually have sea acorns that you can get. You will also find a stranded person like right here. I'm, I'm not paying attention to that person right now because I, I, I have too many people as it is. Um, fine, I'll talk to you. Sethulu, you don't look too glassy. -eyed. Have you seen a mound of loose dirt anywhere on the stupid no good island? Wait, don't answer that. Whole problem's dumb. I hate to say it, but I'm dumb too. Uh, what happened? Oh, like it matters to you. You're just going to laugh at me, which is so unfair. Because usually it's my job to laugh at all the other schmucks. But no, I had to go and bury my luggage. Ha! I said, this will keep it safe and then I won't have to haul it around while I explore. Best part is, I made a stupid map to tell stupid me where I buried the stupid stuff. But I can't parse it because it's a shoddy map. Now I'm stuck here on this organic trash heap forever in the same stupid clothes with none of my stuff. I could try and find it. Wait, you're serious? I didn't see that coming. Okay, so it's literally like right here. So I think we are here and it's here. So the best place, sure. If you think you can make sense of this, by all means try. It's useless to me anyways. Okay. So we are right here and it's this island, I believe. But again, I'm looking for, aha, white shell, and my inventory is full. Son of a biscuit. Getting rid of these cook pots. Because I need two white shells. Hello, little fishy. Dragon fishy or whatever you are. I need two white shells. Anybody got another white shell? Just one, please. I really don't need another. I'm not even looking at the crab village. There's another quest there. So I think this island is, wait, am I on the wrong island? Nope, it's this way. <sighs> Don't know my left from my right. You can also get sand. Those big concentric circles here are sand. This is where it tells you to dig. Inventory's full. Oh my gosh. <sighs> Um, I'm going to get rid of the propeller because, oh my gosh. Okay. Oh, that's not what I wanted to do. Son of a biscuit. <sighs> get rid of them. They're like potatoes. They're called tater drakes. All I'm looking for is another white shell, dogdammit. That's all I want. Just another white shell. No, it's crystal. If I pass it, you can tell me in chat. But I will look at all of these little islands. Just looking for another one. Just looking for a shell. That's all I'm looking for. Just one measly little shell. Okay, surfboard, marble, rocks. Okay. 
I don't see another shell here. But that doesn't mean there isn't one. And sometimes if you look on the map, well, if you make the resource finder and then use it on one of the islands, it'll show you what everything is. But this is everything that can come up on these islands. So that's well, there's an old sign. That's cool. Oh, I could get one of those. I really want this chair. That's an outboard motor. All sorts of things. So these are all the possible spawns on this island, on this set of islands. Ah, white shell. Ha ha. Here you go. Please tell me you found my buried luggage or don't. Saves me the shame at being, being worse at finding things than you are. Here you go. You found it. I never thought I'd see my stuff again. Uh, thank you. I'm Orlando. Pleasure. It's good to meet someone decent for a change. How about uh, you take this and we call it even? I have no space, but sure. Oh, chair. Thank you. With that settled, I should get back to my travels. Uh, unless you happen to know of a good place to live. Sure, move to Critter Cove. Just promise me it isn't gnome infested. I can't do this again or my reputation will be in shambles. Gnome infested. Okay, let me see if I have the stuff to make my friendship bracelets. The thread is at home. Of course it's the thread is at home. I have thread at home, I do. Yep, just got to follow Orlando back to our boat. And this is also where you get the quest to... Oh, no, no, no. Yeah, I don't care. There we go. <laughs> Where you'll, you'll you'll eventually get the quest for the um, museum person. It is this way. See, there's our right there. Oh God, sorry. <gasps> oh my God, I'm terrible. Oh my gosh, sorry about that. You can see in the distance the Critter Cove Island with the big lighthouse in the middle, and also some cargo floating around that we could get, but my inventory is full. Thank you, Riley KS Gaming. And if you don't know who that is, please look her up. She does Dinkum, among other things. A lot of great and wonderful games. And she is a most pleasant person who is totally lovely and totally funny. And her catchphrase is, my pockets are full. <laughs> because they always are, no matter what game we play. Oops, or no matter what game she plays. And you will run into things if they're sticking out of the water like that. Like that cargo thing, Majiggy. Did not want another grumpy villager, but now we have another grumpy villager. I have to make a tent. Thank God I can. My inventory is full. You know what? Sorry, Orlando. You're just going to have to stay here for about two hours while I go empty my inventory and figure things out. It's fine. Even if there's a lightning storm, he'll be fine. Uh, e. Okay. So I need that, 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 that. Um, do I only have two boxes? Are you kidding? Um, can I make a basic, can I make a basic trunk? Trust me, this is what you're going to want if you want um, more storage. Basic trunk. None of these crates, barrels, carry crates, soapbox. None of that. Please tell me that my inventory is not full. Yep, it is. I am going to put this trunk. Did you catch me talking yet? I'm going to sit. I'm going to sit. Mm. I am going to put this trunk down here by the boat so that I have something to... And I know it's, it's backwards. I don't care. It's fine. All your, all your crates, you can put them on different islands. You can put them around this island. You can put them all over the place. And they're all connected. 
So if you really want to put one on e like each of the islands, that's a banger idea as far as I know, um, because then they're all connected and you can just have access to them everywhere. Actually, I need that one. So when you get the rusty tanks, you take them to the tank refill station and they become this. And let me try again to make my tent for this poor guy. I think I had at one point I had like five people living on the beach. I was just like, sorry guys, you're just going to have to rough it. Okay, Orlando. That was a terrible boat ride from the looks of this dump. Things are about to get worse. So we've got that going for us. I don't suppose there's any place for me, any place set up for me to live yet. Of course not. Why would I expect that? Fetch me a tent or something. I hate the idea of camping on the beach, but it's better than nothing for right now. Come back here. You, how's that whole tent thing coming along? Here you go. He just looks angry, doesn't he? You actually did it. I, uh, well, I didn't expect that. I guess you're all right. Hmm. Space is going to be tight. Why don't you do me a favor and take this off my hands? Pillar Industrial. Okay. I'm off to find a place to set this up. Hopefully I won't be stuck in the sand forever. If I do, I'm blaming you. Cool. Another grumpy, another pokey. This guy is exactly pokey, but Giselle's nice. Hey, I found a cook pot pair. I just got rid of two of them. Immediately thought of you. Giselle, I bet Misty could use a cook pot. I bet she would offer 20 doubloons for this amazing find. So how about it? Sure, why not, Giselle? I know, uh, I know you're just dying to do this. Thank you. Yep. And I still don't have an option to hire anybody. My gosh, this is going to kill me. Ugh. I need thread. Thread. Uh, I think I need more than that for the um, for the friendship bracelets. Nope, just one. Excuse me. I need one each. So let's take this tank to the tank refill station. So I have six rusty tanks. So great. Ta-da! So about four and a half minutes. I really do need to make more lights, but I mean, look at the sky. Look how pretty the sky is. I really like the sky in this world. The when it comes up morning and when it starts to go to sunset and then and then after ten o'clock you get like the Milky Way and the moon coming out a lot of times. It's amazing. They really did a good job on it. But it does get dark enough that you kinda do need lights all around town. And if you haven't dismantled the ones that are in there, they're not gonna work. So you physically have to go put one, make them and put them in. Like I did it over here. See this bright light right here? This is like the only lamp in town. So you have to make these and just put them around the town because it's it's a bit dark. A wee bit dark. Just a smidge. What? What do you want, Pokey? She's in need of my help. Um, she wants to eat. She doesn't like meat. Um, if I remember right, so if you do J, um, yeah, Pokey doesn't like anything meat. She does like the blush berries. Um, I do not have any blush berries on me though. So I will look and see if I can find some blush berries. And then I can just give her a blush berry or I can give her like a fruit salad. Wow, I don't have any, any tinder on me at all. Um, I know I got more sticks than that. There we go, 83. Okay. Ah, sorry. <laughs> Losing my mind. So let's see. Uh, fruit salad. I do not have any. Are you kidding me? Well, kind of screwed with that. Um, I 
got dragon fruit. Okay, so we can't make Pokey any food right now, and we still owe Sammy's shop seven um, fruit salads. I really need those planners. Um, but let me see if, if I can make those. Oops. Friendship bracelets. And this way, what you do when you do these friendship bracelets is that gives you the ability to track them on the island. So wherever they are, then all of a sudden you can go, oh, they're over here. I can go find them instead of us looking at the map going, I have no idea where they are. They're just gone. They're not at their house. They're not anywhere else. Um, okay. So there's the Orion. Look at that. Look at that moon. Look at the, you can see all those dragon birds flying around. It's so pretty. Okay. And for some reason they stay out really late. A lot of times there's anchor. See, there's the, the gupper ride. <laughs> Up, oh, Mary, where are you going? Oh gosh, where am I going? Uh, where was Pokey? That's my house. Where's Pokey's house? Um, nope, that's not it. I think we know we owe. So we need one for Mary and Pokey, and Mary, we just we just saw her up here. I lost her. She was up here. That's Giselle. I had Mary and I lost her. I didn't think I needed her. Hi, Sammy. <laughs> See, this says I could remove from Job Cafe. There's also one that says you should be able to hire somebody for that. But, you know. How many apples do you think you could stuff into your mouth at the same time? Um, one? Me too. It's not very impressive, but if you're in the same boat, I feel a little better about it. Good night, Sam. Sammy, what? What? You want new furniture. I have a chair for you. Hey, come here. Um, oh my god, why won't it let me? Oh, because I don't have the chair on me. Don't I? Don't I have the chair on me? Nope, I took the chair off of me. Worst case scenario, I could probably give Pokey some... Is this... No, that's nobody's house. That's nobody's house. And then Mary lives there. Might as well go to bed. Um, and my house is all the way back up here. Ah, uh, that's Anchor. Oh my god, Mary lives here, but I think she's out. This is what I mean. So right now I can see where Reynard is. I can see where Sammy is. I can see where Anchor is. But nobody else. That's going to be our museum. That's going to be a hair cuttery. That's going to be a bakery. Bait shack. This is Sammy's thing. There's probably going to be an exercise place there. So yay. That's Sammy. Um, so we will just go to sleep. And actually, no, it's in my storage. Somebody gave us a bunk bed somewhere. I could have swore they gave us bunk beds. Here it is. We got a bunk bed. So what we can do is take this up, give it to somebody else or sell it. Sleep till morning. I guess we were sleeping on the bottom. You can sleep on the bottom or the top. Okay. All right, so let's try and make some more doubloons. Doesn't look like anybody's out. One of the best ways to make doubloons is this. So I need one rubber for Mary. And you have two days to do this. A metal pipe for Tammy. An old bottle for Giselle. And two quarts for Pokey. 
Um, and they usually in the list, it'll, it'll give you like a base price, but you may get more or less um, for your thing. Like I had one that said 24 and I got like 87. So I was like, oh, well, all righty then. Um, so I need an old pipe. There's an old pipe. I need one rubber. And then what was the other thing? I need furniture, rubber, pipe, an old bottle, and then two crystal. Okay. Old bottle and two crystal. Crystal, you can just dig up on the, there's an old bottle. And there's two crystal. Ta-da! So we have... Uh, I need two of those, but that's only going to get me one. So basically this is just running around trying to find everybody now. Oh, there's more blush. <gasps> I can give her more. That's three. I can make, um, I can make her a fruit salad and that will help a lot. That'll also increase friendship. Uh, fruit salad. And this way you don't get slop. If you do everything that the recipe says, you usually do not get slop. Fruit salad. Okay, so Pokey needs fruit salad and she also needs... So we got six air tanks, so we should be set. Oh, this is my other crazy girl. Oh, this is Taurus. Oh, crap. We are so screwed. Hey, Tammy, I got something for you. Oh, wait, Why? Um, why won't it? Okay. <laughs> I hate this. I don't know what's going on. So these are our Taurus. I think this is Pokey. I have something for you. And I have something else for you. <laughs> she likes it. <gasps> Hey, Mikey, she likes it. Okay, so... There's the crystal. So we had three things for Pokey. Holy cow. So let's see how much he gives us. 72. Oh, man. It's killing me that I cannot hire anybody for this job. Um, look at the little butterfly wings. Oh, that's like my other character, the butterfly wings and the unicorn horn. It's so cute. That is really adorable. Who lives over here? Nobody? Okay. Um, and also what will happen with your oxygen tanks when you're diving. So like right now, I have seven in there. I have the one I'm using, which you can see that green bar down there, that third bar down, um, right up, up this way only has a tiny bit left. Once it's done, it'll say that it's empty and it'll no, it'll disappear basically. And then it'll auto connect to the next one. So if you have three in there, then it's just, it's just going to auto connect the longer you're down there. For colder and for deeper waters, you're going to become cold and your health will start to deteriorate. So you're going to need a wetsuit, but you can't get the wetsuit um, recipe until you assign somebody to the clothing shop. And then they will give you a quest to go to that skyscrapers uh, area that I showed you when we were on our way to find the two white shells. So that's why I'm so upset that I can't get anybody to work there. I know that that probably sounds weird, but I really want that. Because to go to those skyscrapers, you're really going to need to dive a little deeper. And it's going to help so you don't lose your health and you can dive for longer and all this other stuff. So, yeah. 
it's a bit frustrating. And then if your shop isn't open, the cafe is open. So all of the tourists are going to go to the, the cafe, which is great. And then they'll go on the rides here, but they want to go in the shops and spend money. If you can't do that, then uh, you're kind of screwed. Mary. So I need Mary, Tammy, and Giselle. And then I need the furniture. So she didn't have one. I think that's Lynn. That looks like a Taurus. No, that's Orlando. Some people think I'm a grump, which I'm not. <laughs> I'm not a grump. I just don't like half the people I meet, and I only like the other half, half as much as they seem to think. How is it my fault that everyone else is terrible at everything? Yep, you're right about that. Let me go here. See if I can find the chair that I can give to Seme. Oh, Seme. There it is. Get that chair. And I don't know where everybody is. Kitty cat, seriously. No. Oh my goodness. Um, Sammy needed the furniture. Hey, excuse you. I had so many choices. I probably should have figured out what I wanted before I got up here. You're not who I wanted to talk to. I wanted to talk to Sammy. And I keep down to, trying to chop him. Oh, look, I can... Oh, I didn't know I could go in here. Excuse me, Sammy. I'm just trying to chop you up. Um, wait, open? Oh, that's the door. Oh. Okay, so he's making her a meal. Now, thank you for moving out of the way, Sammy. I have something for you, Sammy. Here is your chair. Pretty nice. I bet I can find a nice spot for it in the corner of my place. Thank you. You should consider, you should take this. Consider it a gift for all your help. A windmill. Another windmill? Oh, no. I almost removed him from the job and he would have been heartbroken. He loves his job. Uh, there is a hyena. There is Pokey. Tammy. <sighs> okay. Yeah, I thought I had another windmill, so I got that as a as a found that as a treasure in a boat. Now I have two. Let's go into decorating. It'd be nice if they turned, <laughs> but they don't. Okay, so no, nope, I'm not even going to do that. I got a vest. I think I need the rest of that stuff. So I need the bracelet. Mary wants the rubber, the pipe, and the bottle. Yep, so I need to keep that on me. Surprisingly, that doesn't come out with um, out of your chest. You have to have it in your inventory, which really kind of sucks. So you two are having a conversation. He's riding the thing. Oh, I wonder if I could, do you sell that beach towel, or beach chair? He's got five of these for $75. So I'll buy two, and two parasols, put them down on the beach, and then people can sit on the beach and look at the water.
Ah, not what I wanted to do. Oh my god, this is so glitched. Stop. <laughs> Furniture mode. Definitely don't recommend doing more than one at a time. And then do the paracels, which surprisingly is made out of a fishing rod, as you can see. <laughs> so that's something the tourists can come down here and just chill on the beach. Oops, sorry, Pokey. Um, just don't know where everybody is. So I'll show you Pokey. So now you can see Pokey's face right here running down the beach. There's Sammy, Renard, Anchor, and Copperbottom. Still have no idea where the heck everybody else is. Um, so the tourists, by the end of the day, and they, they'll stay here till about like 9 o'clock, they will, um, or you can just go to sleep and, and then you in the morning when you wake up, it says how much money you made, how much money they spent. And that's your your profit, basically. Um, I was going to do something. Now I can't remember what the heck I was going to do. <sighs> ah, so confused. Um, okay. <laughs> oh, my my friend Ramanara, who is another streamer that you must check out if you like fun, entertaining streamers. She is definitely the one. Um. She does a lot of Dinkum. She does a lot of other games. Super nice, super funny. She is an awesome streamer. Help her. She's on her way to 700 subs. So if you feel like it, check her out. If you like it, feel free to like a sub. There you are. My place needs to overhaul new furniture pieces. Um, sure, but I have something for you, like three different things. This is exactly what I wanted. My most, you're my most favorite person in the whole wide world right now. Look at it sparkles and it fits perfectly. The little blinky light is a perfect bonus. Now you know where. I'll, now you'll always be able to know where I am. Just like in the olden days when people put these small f on their put these on their small furred companions. I guess they put them around their necks or something backbone. I'm going to strut around and show this off to everybody. I wouldn't be surprised if everyone starts asking you for one of these once they see this. Whoa, whoa, come back here. I have something for you. The rubber you wanted. Missyville, I'm like super duper excited right now. I just knew you'd come through for me. Thanks ever so much. You're like the best. So we got nine doubloons for that. You cheapscape. <laughs> she was so cheap. Oh my god, nine doubloons. You know how much it costs for that piece of rubber? You can buy it at Renard's. It's super expensive. Well, not super expensive. I'm not expensive. Not that expensive, but still super cheap for her to do that. Uh, come into parlay with old anchor. Now with it, what can anchor do for you? Sometimes I miss my life at sea, but there'll be plenty to do here keeping to keep old anchor busy. Besides, it'd be best if I stay out of the grasp of the sea for now anyways. A lot of the times he's going to be the quest giver, I found, like that control panel. Um, so if you're stumped for quests and you're not quite sure, just talk to him or talk to Reynard. And they should be able to give you another quest to do. Let's see. I think I have to make the controller. So what this controller does, which is down by where your boat is docked, it will allow you to upgrade your boat. Um, I have to make it. So that means I have to go here. Control panel. Uh, so I need wire, two metal frames, and the electronic parts. I've got the damage control panel. Um, so wire. Um, so I can make wire out of this. I think I need to make more metal bars. Just saying. Probably should make some brick. Oh, I don't have that much stone. Oh, that sucks. Let's back up with that. Um, well, I can make some softwood planks. Trust me, you'll need softwood planks. 
uh, the further, the more people, the more villagers you get in, it goes from regular planks to, to softwood planks. And then after you've done like three of those or two of those, then you need hardwood planks. And I still have not figured out where you get that. Um, pardon me. I'm sitting here going, what am I looking for? Um, okay. Wait. Um, street lamp. Oh, I can make two more. Yep, I can make two more lights. Yes, thank you. All right, so we can make two more lamps. The town will not be so dark anymore. I'm going to put one right here. Oh, I love that if you do this, it tries to attach to the wall like sideways and I'm like, um, no, not quite. So I'll put that one there oh, and then we'll just do this. So I've got that one right there. I am going to put one right over right there. And so these will, these will light up at night. And it'll make it, I need to put like every five or 10 feet. Um, are you just, oh, he's, I found myself a furnace a while back and I don't want it. I'll let it go for the generous price of 24 doubloons. I'll take it. With a spiky head. I always use another furnace. Um, so I don't know where, oh, they're there. I was going to say, I don't know where all the customers went, but apparently they're all here having lunch. These are cute little tables with X treasure maps for a uh, tablecloth. And this is the lead house. Now you can jump off here. You don't take fall damage, apparently. It's always good to run around and check. I think it's every three or four days that your, there's Giselle, that your fruit and meat um, respawn or after a storm if you have a lightning storm or a thunderstorm then your stuff everything should respawn nine doubloons again what is going on here is that word delight don't mind me i'm just working on my sweet moves people wonder how i can dance without any music the secret is i just turn on my head music got it do the same thing Ooh, wooden planks Alrighty. Okay, so I think this is where, oh, <laughs> this is Orlando, this is where Orlando is staying. I need some rocks, <gasps> a blue shell, rocks. You can chop these logs, they will respawn. They are not part of the clean up the town, because um, I thought that was the case. I kept chopping them up and I didn't realize that it was this little tiny, little tiny piece of metal that I had left there and I was like oh man okay so I think we we're pretty good our little windmills look good we got through a few quests let me see what else I have here I still haven't been able to do the cafe um, Tammy oh she needs another pipe no wonder she wouldn't talk to me Oh, and I need more, two more bars. Okay. <laughs> I almost had it. Okay. Well, thank you so much for hanging out. That's where we're going to leave it for right now because I need to go talk to Critter Cove and find out why I can't assign anybody to the clothing shop. But thank you so much. I really appreciate each and every one of you for stopping by. Don't forget to hit that like and subscribe button if you like my content. Don't forget to tell a friend. And I will see you next time. Bye now.